Hey everyone, I hope you're having a great day so far today. I was just watching a Graham Stephan video and I thought to myself, whatever happened to me making videos like on a daily basis? I used to make tons of videos like on a day to day basis and I fell out of it. And in this video, I want to tell you guys why, why I want to get back into it because well, I'll just start off with that, why I want to get back into it. Because, you know, I really enjoy making these videos. I do them all in one take, and I give my full opinions on all sorts of different subjects. And I really enjoy the, the process. I enjoy the feedback I receive. I, I really love my subscribers. Like, I've had good conversations with them. And I just have been off of it so much recently because, once again... <laughs> <laughs> you guys are gonna laugh at me if you're my subscribers because I've already had this happen once before but I let some homeless people live in my house and I don't know why I just don't really like making videos I get hella depressed when I have homeless people live in my house right now I'm in a huge state of depression I've been fucked over on a few deals like I uh was dumb enough to hire a moving company don't even tell me about how dumb it is to hire a moving company because now I know always move yourself if you ever if you didn't know this before this video, always move your stuff yourself. Nothing really got broken, but they went way over the estimate. It cost way too much money. So anyway, I'm going to start making a little bit more videos going forward. And it's because I really have a lot of good advice to share, I think. And in this video, I want to just give you guys a catch up of everything that's been going on other than letting bums live in my house once again they were paying me for a little bit this time but then they just ended up you know being complete shit bags who stole from me once again so anyway i'm back in colorado i was gonna move to colorado before all this happened anyway because i really missed my family and i miss being here and i'm back at my dad's house and i was before that doing real estate inside of uh Indiana. I guess I haven't made a single video now that I think about it, but I haven't done a single video on real estate or on any of the things I've been doing in real estate. But yes, I've been very busy. Uh, I took my real estate exam. I haven't really even been making videos much until the George Floyd video I made the other day, just because I've honestly felt like I needed to say something about it. I had an opinion that I really felt like the world needed to hear, and I had a uh, uh, just a way that they could stop the protest. Like I said, guys, just give the people what they want. Give the people what they want. Tell the cops that they can't do that kind of shit. Tell the cops that they'll be held accountable. Tell the cops that they see their friends or their partners or whatever doing it, their fellow cops, that they'll be held accountable if they don't stop them. It's really easy. You just have to hold the cops accountable, give them body cameras, just make a federal mandate. No, it's part of the Constitution. Cruel and unnecessary punishment. Um, cruel and unusual punishment. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry. Cruel and unusual punishment. But anyway... Um, yeah, so I was doing real estate for a little while, guys, and, you know, the biggest thing is, is when you fall out of a habit, it really gets hard to get back into a habit, and my habit in this case is taking five minutes out of my day to just sit down and explain what's going on in my life, what my thoughts are on current events, you know, I like either moderate the news or, you know, interpret the news or whatever it is, I know that people in general might like to hear my opinion. So I really want to get back on it. And I know that YouTube can be a great source of side income. I mean, don't be a hater. Please just subscribe, guys. I mean, please just don't be a hater. Just subscribe. I mean, it's an easy thing to do. You can just subscribe. And then hopefully one day I'll get above a thousand subscribers. I mean, that might have been one of the reasons why. Excuse the notification sound. I'm sorry about that. But anyway, that, that, that wasn't really the reason why. It's because I was getting depressed for a while. I was drinking too much. Um, too much King Cobra 40s. Those are really bad for you. Can't even do it. I'm trying to get healthier, guys. As far as updates on life, I'm trying to get healthier. I just paid a hell of a lot for a moving service. And a lot of what I had moved was dried food. Check out how much uh, dried uh lentils and rice and beans and all of that i've got i've got tons of dried food so i'm gonna not have to go to the grocery store for a good amount of time because my brother's garden has all the fresh vegetables i need he's got a massive garden salads every day from now on i've been getting a beer belly i'm probably almost 200 i'm almost 200 pounds i'm the fattest i've ever been and um if you don't start getting your stuff back in order that's 
what happens. That's why as a DJ and as an artist, I call myself level one. Because every day, you can start over again at level one. And, it, you know, you can be level 75, but you're just a level one 75 person. You know what I'm saying? You're level one at being that level. You're the start of that level. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, so, yeah, anyway, right now I'm definitely at level one. I'm getting fat. I tried to do chin-ups yesterday. It was like two chin-ups and one chin-up and I can already feel my arms hurting. Two, I could barely do two. Tried to do three, couldn't do three. It's bad, guys. I used to be able to do over 20 chin-ups, you know what I'm saying? It's bad. Anyway, trying to get back to being healthy trying to get my life back in order. Oh, right now I used to be in, in real estate, but right now I'm looking for just a regular old job in accounting and I have a degree in accounting. I'm just trying to get back into accounting guys. You know, I'm still going to be doing DJing and these videos on the side, but I really got to get back into accounting because you can make a lot of money in it. And honestly, I've come to appreciate the stability of a nine to five where you can still work on your own thing in the off hours, but you get paid like three grand stable income because here's what you can do with that three grand. Okay. If you make 40,000 a year, see, I have a degree in accounting. I'm getting <coughs> job opportunities. That's one of the good things about moving out here to Denver. I didn't even think about is there's way more accounting jobs out here. It's a bigger city and stuff. But anyway, if I get a job opportunity at 40,000 a year, that's a little over 3,000, it's 3,333 you know, 33 and 33 cents and all that per year. And at that point, you're making uh, enough to where you can put a thousand into stocks and then a thousand away towards your house per month and hopefully have a roommate and pay it off, you know, and all that. Try to get yourself a house, guys. Housing is always very key. But anyway, first time homebuyer assistance programs. But anyway, um, what you got to... Uh, consider is if you put that thousand towards the stocks like i was saying a thousand a month per per month towards the stocks three and a half years from now if not even considering gains you're gonna be at forty thousand dollars okay so this is what we're gonna do with that forty thousand dollars by then you're gonna have to learn how to see i'm always on the day trading stuff guys i'm always on day trading if you know anything about my channel from way back in the day i love day trading i think it's all about i think that's where it's at i think it's literally where it's at because this is what you do with that forty thousand dollars see if you get a 2.5 percent return per week then you can have a thousand dollars a week and then you can replace your job you can literally replace your job after three and a half years if you can learn how to get two and a half percent per week now let me tell you how easy it is to get two and a half percent i saw a sock sun power uh it's a it's solar energy company sun power spwr is their symbol i believe it is um or their abbreviation but anyway i bought them for eight dollars and 15 cents i was like this company looks like it's kind of undervalued i know this company it should be more like ten dollars the depression's kind of over solar power is fine and sure enough, it went up today by 11%. Well, I sold out at 3%. So in one, uh, when I got 3% return. So just today, I sold at $8.37 or something like that. And I got a, a right around 3% return. So if I did no other plays all week and I'd put all my money on the line, that's two and a half percent per week a thousand bucks a week if i had forty thousand bucks i would have made a thousand bucks for that play if i put it all on sun power that's an easy one because later that day went up to eleven percent there was another company beyond meat today because they just put out a factory in china or whatever it went up twenty percent if you put your money on beyond Meat and you had forty thousand dollars you could have just done one trade today ten percent just get a ten percent oh wait no a twenty percent trade get ten thousand dollars you don't have to make another trade for two or three months, guys. If you can get a 20% trade, you don't even have to trade. Just look for that good deal, guys. Just look for the good deals and get some money in the stock markets. And you won't have to do anything. You'll just have to chill. You know what I'm saying? I'm getting my money up there to where I get pretty good returns, but I don't get like $1,000 days like pretty much ever. But anyway... I don't want to ramble on and on in this video, guys. If you've seen my videos, I always finish it with that because I do literally always ramble on and on. And, you know, I'm not even talking about what this video is originally about. So basically what I'm saying, guys, is I was doing real estate for a while. I'm still going to do real estate out here, but more so just uh, connection based people that I meet, you know, referral based organic leads, you know, not trying to do that whole hustle of Zillow leads and all that Zillow leads suck anyway. So, um, <sighs> I'm trying to get a job in accounting, trying to build up my stock account. Cause right now I got a little under 4,000. I need to get up to like 40,000 up to like a hundred thousand, get it up to where the money is. 
like to where I can get some good returns. Two and a half percent on a hundred thousand bucks is two twenty five hundred dollars. So anyway, I appreciate you guys all watching the video. I'm sorry I ramble on and on so much, but I appreciate you guys watching the video. And uh, if you haven't already, please subscribe. I'm going to try to start doing videos every day from now on. Um, I really enjoy doing the videos. I enjoy you all watching my videos. I hope you enjoyed watching the videos. Well, I should say, I really hope you enjoy, guys enjoyed watching the video. And until next time, peace.